It's like something with Winnie the Pooh, like he. Oh, oh, whoa. Yeah, what, like, is he like character. a serial killer? Where's the Winnie the Pooh? I got you. I have to tell you this. We all grew up watching cartoons, but did you know about the dark conspiracies behind them? What dark conspiracies? There's conspiracies, but uh, today we're gonna try out the foods. And we'll talk about the conspiracies. I like it. There's a Winnie the Pooh one. That's the only one I know. It's like something with Winnie the Pooh, like he, he's like, Something mentally. Oh, oh, whoa, whoa. Yeah, no, like each like character. A killer? So I don't know. I don't know. We'll oh get to God. it. We'll figure it out. Okay, let's go. Bring let's go. First food. Mm. Oh, it's like a crab and Oh, that's a crabby patty, right? Deal. Nah. <laughs> oh, thank you. Patty. SpongeBob SquarePants Krabby Patty. Oh. Nobody knows the secret Krabby Patty formula. Of course. But this is as close as we get. Mm. Ready? Okay. Dark truth time. Oh. Mr. Krabs did not reveal the secret formula because it'll prove that he is a serial killer. Shut up. Oh, I, I can see that, he's sketchy. There's evidence, there's sketchy. evidence. Why do we never see his wife? Because they got divorced, maybe? Because he killed her for the whale meat. Shut up, that's too far, bro. No, it goes expensive Shut on the black up. market. Because his daughter's a, a whale. Okay, So maybe he wife. adopted the daughter. Maybe, I don't know. What mm -hmm. happened to the health inspector? What health you inspector? watched a lot of SpongeBob growing up, yeah? Yeah, I did. So what happened? I don't actually don't know what happened to the Elvis Like he went home, maybe? Was he like there and then he disappeared or he just never showed up again or what? What? You're right, he never shows back up. He's gone because he, he killed him and grinded him up for a crappy petty. So it's not actually crabs in there, it's fish too. Well, what happened to all the crabs in Bikini Bottom? They all moved like Kung Fu Panda. No? They in the crappy patties, man. You only see one crab ever? <laughs> oh man. Yo. Wow. What about Miss Puff? All right, well, Bob, it's Bob. Did you know she was an ex-killer? Okay, you're going to fuck. No! <laughs> oh, there's an episode on SpongeBob, and they go to driver school, and there was a shot where we see Mrs. Puff in the newspaper, and it explains that she ran away. Oh, what if she's a doppelganger? Like, somebody took over her life. There's so many conspiracies. There's so many conspiracies. I did not know that. But this is a good crime fire. Tastes like whale. You ever had whale? <laughs> you no. ever whale? But why is there so much onion? That's not onion. What is that? That's whale eyeballs. That's, he that's health inspector. <laughs> you know Bikini Bottom? What? It's based off of a true site where America is used to uh, drop uh, like nuclear bombs in this place. What is it called? Bikini Atoll. Bikini Atoll. What? That's actually why the bikini is named the bikini. Mm-hmm. Bikini Atoll? That's why all the fishes there, they can talk. Because they're like mutants. Radiation. 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 Exactly. You go next. You ready for this? I'm ready. That's a dark. Cool. What do you mean dark? Dark. Like Winnie the Pooh dark? I gotta refresh my memory on that one. Mm. It's, it's in there somewhere. Mm. Oh my gosh, the sixth one is crazy. What? Uh, let's go back to two. No, go to two. Okay. Come out, cartoon number two. What do you have for us? Oh! Pika Pika! Pika Pika Pika! Mm. Oh, you got some food for us, Mr. Pika? Come on. Thank All you. Right. Pika! Thank you, sir. Pikachu! Thank oh, yeah. you, Pikachu. What this? This is onigiri, also known as rice balls. Onigiri. It's a uh, very popular. Brock cooks a lot. He's a chef, so he really loves bringing these to Ash and Misty back in the day. Oh, okay. Do you know the dark truth? No. What? Well, in the episode where Brock introduces this, they address this rice ball, onigiri, yeah, as a donut. It's in, clearly not a donut. Wait, in like the subtitles or something? In the subtitles. In the dub version, they said this is a donut. These donuts are great. Why? The reason why is because America had a trade war with Japan at the time, 1990s. So they didn't want any association with the Japanese culture during the 1990s. So instead of saying just something simple as rice ball, they said donut because they wanted to brainwash the kids in eating donuts rather than embedding themselves in this Japanese culture. What? Yeah, it's weird. What's a trade war? Listen, when in the 90s, you ever wonder why you turn things around since made in China instead of made in Japan? I just thought everything was made in China. Because we had good relationships with China. You know, Japan hated us at the time, and they didn't want the things to go to America. They didn't want things to say made in Japan. Are we good now? I hope so. <sighs> so let's have some donuts. Yeah, no to no chinski to ninski, bro. What's in this? Mmm. Rice, beef, seaweed, and fun other things. I'm covering my mouth because some of you guys in the comment don't like seeing my mouth open when I eat. <laughs> and my mom either. Close your mouth. You don't do that. 
And you're in his mom. <laughs> a bunch of haters. What do you think? It's good. It's good. I really like it. Mm -hmm. This next one is about the Ninja Turtles. Oh, what about the Ninja Turtles? Ninja Turtles, as you know. Yeah, of course. They were abandoned turtles and flushed down the toilet by a scientist who also spilled toxic goo on them. Okay. Yeah. That makes a lot of sense. There was a fifth turtle the scientists wanted to experiment on. What happened to the fifth turtle? That turtle turned into Franklin the turtle. Who's Franklin the turtle? Yeah, Franklin, Franklin, the, Franklin, 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 the, Franklin, 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 Franklin
Sure. What is ratatouille? Do we know? Ratatouille is a bunch of sliced things, sliced uh, zucchini. I thought it was meat. No, it's, it's just veggies. Meat. It's actually rat. <laughs> Wait, it's vegetarian? Yeah! I really thought there was like a bunch of sliced like salami or something. No, it's that's like squash. No way. And like, there's tomato. In the, in the movie, it looks like it. Yeah. No, it does not. It looks yeah, like it, vegetables in the movie. Does it? Comment below. Did you think it, the ratatouille in the movie was is made of meat? meat or vegetables? It's healthy though, I think. Mmm. Dang, I'm, I'm sad. Why? I thought it was gonna be uh, meat. I thought I was gonna have like a freaking meat buffet in my mouth hole right now. Does that change your opinion about Ride 2 being one of your favorite Disney movies? No, it's so good. Uh -oh. I went to Disneyland Paris. Mm -hmm. It was the only good ride. Oh yeah. Did you? No. It's nice. Mm. It's like uh, you're in a cart, but you're like the rat and there's screens all around you and it's like you're running through the restaurant and then you like dive onto a cart, under a cart. And then he runs around and he has to run through the kitchen. He has to run up poles and you're like, what? It's cool. I want to go with it one day. Let's go. Paris, if you're watching this, sponsor us. <laughs> I'm done. Conspiracy number six? Number six. Let's go. Let's get right to it. I have to tell you this. All right, you ready for this? This is the one you've been waiting for. I'm excited. Yeah, this is a crazy one. Uh, okay. Rugrats. Ooh. You ready? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that's Chucky. A, that's a sick bit. That is awesome. Nice. Oh, 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 it's a reptile so bar. Funny. I'm a little rug rat. I don't even care. <laughs> <laughs> Just a little rat on the rug. Here's the dark truth about rug rats. None of the rug rats actually exist except Angelica Pickles. The older one. Yeah, the crazy, angry one. Yeah. All right. You know, you know why? Why? So all of the Rugrats exist because they are figments of Angelica Pickles' imagination. Angelica Pickles was neglected by her parents. Yeah. The, thus, she just invented all the Rugrats in her mind. So those are her imaginary friends, but family. So imaginary family. Yeah. But, oh, listen, check Tommy. this out. She's only related to Tommy. Right? No. Tommy never existed. He was born a stillborn baby. What? Yeah, that's why, it, that explains why his father, Stu Pickles, yeah. is always down in the basement making toys for a son he never had. All right? How about Chucky? What? He Chucky, died? She died with his mother. Okay. That's why um, Chucky's dad is a nervous wreck every single time. Okay? Uh, how about the DeVilles? Lil the and twins. Phil. The twins. Okay. They had an abortion. But the parents did not know the sex of the baby, so she invented female and male twins to compensate for that. Is that it? Yeah, that's it. Mm. Reptar bars. Oh, Ooh. nice. What's the green? Oh. Mmm. Mmm. That green tea? What? Uh, Mint? I don't like it. What? Just kidding. It's good. Mmm. Uh, uh, oh, look. It's good. I was gonna do it, too. Mmm. Mm. Did you like the conspiracy? Was it too that crazy? That was crazy. I'm ready for your Winnie the Pooh fact. I know! The dark secrets of Winnie the Pooh? It's probably next, it's probably next, let's see. Next up we have The Simpsons Conspiracy. Mm. The dark secret is that the Simpsons can predict the future. I'm sure everybody's heard that. The theory is that one of the writers are in touch with a time traveler. <laughs> yeah. No way. So he'll just pitch it like it's not a big deal, knowing that it's gonna happen. You know there are people that can actually like see the future. Do you believe it? Yeah, you ever see Final Destination? They call yeah. it premonitions. Some people yeah. have that thing where it's like they, they zone out, but they're daydreaming. But they think it's like actually happening and they snap back, like, oh shit, that wasn't real. That's how deja vu is. What you know they about say that it happened before. It's, it's like, like your previous life? Yeah, it's like, or it's already happened, but then like, you predicted the future, and then when it happened again, that's why it seems so familiar. It's so weird when that happens. Yeah. Does everyone get deja? Do you get deja vu? Let me know in the comments down below because when that thing hits, yeah, I'm like, I get like, I don't know. It's you know, like, you, <gasps> what? You know the other, the other conspiracy about deja vu? What? Well, they say the theory of multiverse, yeah, actually exists. The other you in another universe, yeah. does the same exact things. That's when they cross. Yeah. And then oh. they go. Because multiverses are just like little like yeah. pathways. So yeah. when one of them touches, whoever. The same thing is, happens. Yeah. Oh. And then they just go. You know the opposite of deja vu? Uh, uh, why? Jamais vu. You know what that is? Nope. 
It's when you're doing something, I get this more than deja vu. It's when you're doing something that you've done a million times, but it feels like the first time. Like when you get in your car and you forget like how to turn it on and you're like, wait, oh, and then you click it. Or if you go to your phone and you're looking for an app and then you're like, wait, you go to the app every day and then you just can't remember where it is in your phone. And you're like, Oh, yeah, yeah, it's right here. Oh. Yeah, that's jamais vu. I get that a lot. I thought me it was too. me getting old, not remembering things anymore. <laughs> no. Let's bring out the donut. Donuts. Samson. Who's it going to be? Which character? <laughs> <laughs> it's Homer. Homer. Oh, Homer's not that. Oh, he's sad because he's giving us his donut. Ah, oh, that's right. Oh. Thank you, Homer. Thanks, Homer. All right, thanks for the donut. Don't. Don't. Don't, 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 don't! I respect you, Homer. I'm yeah. having deja vu. Yeah? Okay. Because I just keep coming out here. Oh, dang. <laughs> uh, I feel like I'm gonna have nightmares about that one. Here's what happened. Uh. This is the popular Simpsons donut because Homer would go to the Quickie Mart mm -hmm. uh, with Apu. Yeah. And he would take all the candies, unwrap them, and put them on the donut, and try to pass them off as toppings so he can get them for free. <laughs> hey, that's smart. This is an interesting looking ass donut. Yeah, they have a Mounds Bar, Twizzler, M&M's, Jolly Rancher. I've never actually had a Mounds Bar. Is it coconut? Mm-hmm. Mm. You yeah. like? Nope. This is one of the things I throw away whenever I go trick or treating. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> you do? I don't like Twizzlers. What? I don't. It's a low calorie sweet. I don't like it. You think time travelers really do exist? If you're a time traveler, uh huh, would you tell other people that you're a time traveler, or would you keep it a secret? Um, I tell you. You would tell me. Yeah. Okay. What if like every lottery winner is a time traveler? Could be. If you won the lottery, would you tell me? No. When? Um, probably I next time I see you. The first thing you're supposed to do when you win the lottery is not tell anybody for like the first year. Why? So no one knows about it. Well, I mean, other than your accountant. So I'll tell like, you. I oh, appreciate it. It's good. It is good. <laughs> yeah. How do you like it? I'm done with that. Where's the Winnie the Pooh? I got you. Let me tell you about what this is. This is it? Pooh. Let's go! The next cartoon? Tell me about it. Tell me about it. Winnie the Pooh. Woo! All right, before I tell it, let's show the food. Bring out the food. <laughs> it's Homer Simpson! <laughs> Homer! Is it honey? Honey is all I'm giving them? This this personality fits Eeyore a lot more than Homer. Oh, dude, is that Mike Sully? We, we, we didn't have time to get all the makeup off. It's okay. I just kind of kind of like it now. I think Eeyore talks a lot slower. Well, it's my take on it. <laughs> okay, bye Eeyore. All right, let's try this honey. What's what's Winnie the Pooh so honey about? Dude, it tastes a little better with uh, coming out of the, um, whatever you the call stick? it. The stick? What's the right word for this? Oh! Oh, damn. I think it just looks like a hive. Oh, yeah. But the conspiracy is every single character on Winnie the Pooh represents a mental disorder. Ooh! But this yeah. is true. This is true. Yeah. I think. That's, no, I know. It's true. It's true. It matches too well to be a conspiracy. It has to be true. Winnie the Pooh. Yep. Represents addiction. Oh. We see that with addicted to honey. Yep. An addict, addict, boom, boom, boom. Honey, 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 honey. Let me guess, pick a character, I'll guess it. What is Piglet? Uh, anxiety. He's scared of everything. Mm -mm. Is that, no? Yes, it is, it oh, is. Oh, God. It is, but it's, it's more specifically severe anxiety disorder. Oh. Acronym for sad. Oh. Also, that's pretty crazy. Oh. All right, oh, rabbit. What's the rabbit? Uh, neurotic, like Monica from Friends. Mm, rec He's reclusive. Reclusive. Just wants to be, be alone. Be alone. To so get away from me. We get away from everything. Yeah. Everybody. The world. Yeah, he's just grumpy. Mm. The owl. I don't remember anything about the owl. OCD. Oh, why? Obsessive compulsive disorder. disorder. Oh, okay. Yeah, he just likes things in a specific way. Okay. Eeyore. What do you think Eeyore has? Uh, he has, okay, he talks slow. He's, he's tired all the time. He has uh, depression. Clinical depression. That's Very crazy. Sad. Tigger. Oh, Tigger is, oh, that's me. ADHD just jumping, bouncing off the walls. How about Kanga and Roo? I don't know that one. Multiple personality disorder. No way. Sometimes it's the, the Kanga, sometimes it's the Roo. That's a made up one. <laughs> you made that one up. Hey, it's good, right? 
Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday, 11, 11 a.m. If you're not smiling, you're doing it wrong. Stay juicy. Stay juicy. Oh, sorry, brother.